what do you know of or about Alice Munro we need to know, that Canadians need to really remember? She's a really, really wonderful person. Yeah. How so? Well, she just is. It's like saying, you know, why does the sun shine? Yeah. So, I mean, why does because it shine? it's there. Hmm? Because it's there. Yeah. She's a wonderful person. Okay, I've known her for a very, very long time. Yeah. And uh, she's a friend. And what do you say about your friends, except that they're very, very wonderful people? And a great writer. Yeah, that too. But that, that we, take, we take that... That's a given. If you, when you take your name and Alice Monroe's name out of the list of you know, books submitted for awards, the, the ratio of how many women to men or trans to women to men is so much smaller and concerning. Um, do you see it change? Is it improving in a way that you like it? Well, okay, so in the 70s, it was the men who were complaining that they were outnumbered. Right. Uh, and that, but they've made a comeback. So how did they make the comeback? I think they just tried really hard. <laughs> so are you suggesting that there are not enough women in writing because the women aren't trying hard no, enough? No, no, there's a lot of women in writing. Yeah. Uh, and there's a lot of women writing really well. Uh, and I can't say too much about this because I am a Giller judge this year, but it is a very rich year for writing. Mm -hmm. So some years you think, okay, so these made it onto the list because there weren't very many out there. But this year, there are a lot of very, very good books. It's a very rich coral reef ecosystem in the world of Canadian prose writing right now. Mm -hmm.